Hello. I'm gonna open up Sunclair. Is that you, soldier? Was that you by the plane? Yeah, how did you get loose from that grip of that My thing? Eyes. Oh, I can't see a thing. But they cannot deceive me anymore. It's all lies. None of it is true. None of it! Hello. Come on in. Come. Come, come. The punks are right this way, sir. Supreme Army Command. We must inform Supreme Command. Uh huh. The Kaiser needs to know what's happening here. The war isn't over. The enemy is here. Here, here, I'm gonna let you, let you down, gently. We have to win the war, do you hear? For the fatherland and for ourselves. Don't listen to the traitors and deserters. Please, you have to help. Give me something. Uh, morphine. To calm uh, my nerves. Something for the pain. Uh, there was morphine in here somewhere. Uh, There's a medical transport to the north. Please. Okay. Okay. I don't know. I I, I can't I can't stand for what you stand for. But I can't see a man suffer. The enemies are in your head. It was them. The enemy. It was them. But it can't have been. We need to make a report. We need to. They're coming. They're coming. They're coming. No, that's just me leaving. Here, I'll, I'll, I'll get you something. I'll get you something. Stay, 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 stay safe. Yeah, okay, this doesn't. That's good. I, I thought, I thought this was like close shot. <laughs> Brewery steps. If you didn't trip any of these, that would be a miracle. Latrian duty. The lieutenant, ha lieutenant has put Weber, Kaspar, and myself on Latrian duty for three weeks. Which is? Can't say I'm used to that saying. We didn't do anything. Okay, there's something bad. It seems that he had a row with the radio operator. A family quarrel, perhaps? Ah, with me. <laughs> In any case, he has chosen us as the targets for his wrath. He called us cowards. We didn't even hear what they were arguing about. Casper cried all night. First his fiancée stops writing to him. Then three weeks of latrian duty. He doesn't deserve this. Rudy Lohmann. No one deserves to even be here, so... Latrina. Smells like it too. Why is it Latrina? Like, like something bad. Like a sewer or something. Okay, it's just like a way to go pee or something. The stink of the Latrinas is almost unbearable. Being on cleaning duty here would be a horrible punishment. I'm gonna assume, yeah, you have like toilet paper. Like, I first heard like bandage or so, but I suppose it's like toilet paper. I mean, everyone has to do nature's bidding. Duty roster. Duties for the next week. Sweeping. Feldwald Neue. Feldwald Retschlaff. 
Kitchen und der Offizier Schmitz Hans. Gefreiter Henning. The Fried Henning, what? Geht es für die nächsten drei Wochen. Let's read this. Feldwebel, Lohmann, Feldwebel, Weber, Gefreiter Hafner. And thank you for that. This is a job that needs to be done regardless. Well, you shouldn't put anyone on punishment for that. It should be equal. Okay, let's see if we can find some more fun or something like that. Brewery and Hamburg Avenue. Hamburg Avenue. That sounded heavy, like something, like someone hung somewhere. Uh, we shall not go there. Those were quite some brambles. Hamburg. A nickname, I suppose. Um, <laughs> because this would be a very sorry excuse for an avenue, I guess. <laughs> Flooding. Where is all this water coming from? If it goes on like this, we will surely all drown here. Jansen said he's used to it from back home, the old sea dog. But I doubt there are this many rats in the Baltic. Disgusting creatures. And they bite too. Fairweather, bravo. Well, then you move around and show that you're not dead. He will have to wait for the meal. Hopefully not any rats here anymore. Once they have depleted their dead bodies, I'm sure they're moving on somewhere. Can you stomp any less? Okay, maybe he stomps to chase away. <laughs> rats. Hunger in the trench. We've had nothing but bad luck ever since the new officer arrived. Bad luck and starvation. I could eat a horse. Jansen cooked a rat that bit him. <laughs> a wrench. His legs all swollen up. He actually ate the creature, too. I couldn't stomach it. It makes me sick to think what the hunger is doing to us. Feldwebel Bravo. Well, you know, that's very recent. Because if you don't eat, you don't live. Stompy, stompy. No rats shall bite me. Scare away snakes, rats, mice. Whatever not. Rodents. Despair. Am I just gonna leave this fella behind me? <laughs> this guy writhing in pain, slowly dying. That is extremely, extremely foggy. <laughs> um, okay. Hopefully, there's the no mice. I will go far. Father always said so. It was his dying wish. Your father is gone. He built this house for himself, no one else. Lichtefender, of all places. All so he could send your harness to the Cadet Academy. And now Paul, too. More heirs, more soldiers. That's all I was ever good for. The Academy would have done Johannes the power of good. You've seen for yourself what your coddling has done to him. It's a disgrace. Fight for uh, like, like fight. the father would be like, you have to fight a war. There has to be a war just because. Even if it doesn't have to be a war, we shall have a war. Oh, the horses have completely burnt to a crisp.
Morphine, yeah. Sanitatstipod. You found a vial of morphium. 1916. 0.02%. Morphium hydrochloride. Yeah, come on, take more. Ah! <laughs> no! Did someone shoot at me? Oh my god! Okay, yeah. I just want to ease, ease the suffering, mother. Okay, maybe, maybe they are not on modern maturity terms right now. Fair enough. Go, we shall go, 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 go. go. <laughs> yeah. God, stand on, stand on wooden cranks, and kick off. Oh. Oh. He's your son. Oh, mon Dieu, c'est ton fils. You know I won't tolerate that language under my roof. Your father's words again. You cannot even speak. Nonsense! Father was right. You've already warped one of my sons with your hysteria. I won't allow you to ruin the other! I know that's my husband gone. Once Paul leaves, I shall be all alone in this house. Just me. And your father. So, sh that, that was an emergency of our mother being very scary S chasing us because it felt like she was going for us because she was yelling at the father in our house while we're in a coma but she wasn't really going to go for us it just felt threatening because she yelled it was not directed at us Allgemeine Zeitung it's a newspaper that uh... yeah let's go on because I have a feeling that our nightmare version of Mother is still out there. Oh. This is like when we... Okay, there we go. Okay! This is like when we ran in the trenches. It sounds like me when I was stuck to the... Oh my god! When I was stuck to the barbed wire. Oh! oh. Uh Breathing in my neck. Oh, okay, okay. I wanted to. Oh, oh. I wanted to crouch out there. <laughs> Did not work. <laughs> yep, waking up as if it's like a nightmare. It's just that we don't really wake up. We're in a coma. I'm gonna maintain that opinion. Oh. Ah. Despair, a poem. Despair like a night, you return again. You leave me with a knot, neither hair nor flesh. Hang on again. Despair like the night, you return again. 
You leave me with naught, neither hair nor flesh, not even the courage to put an end to this pain. So was that our brother? Because Mark seemed to hate our brother in every flashback that we had. Was that our brother that we talked to? He seemed to place a lot of trust in us, but he said trust no one. That's not what he said per se, but it's the impression I got. So, uh, I don't know, maybe that was our brother. This feels like heaven in a way. Going into the white light. This feels like heaven's gates. Although not without trouble. It's burning. Dan L. Oh, I can't read this font. Then in Un Eden, she created the dead garden, Gehenna. Hmm. This feels so vague, but it makes me feel so emotional and enriching, and I don't even entirely know what's going on, but. I don't know what's going on with the protagonist here. And all I know is just that we have to carry on. Like, I'm pretty sure we're in a coma and all, but... And the mind is trying to comprehend everything that's happened. Trying to... Run away from the mother shouting at father. In den Toten Garten setzte sie den... Menschen... Den Menschen, den sie geformt hatte. So she buries her own children, is that what it says? I can't, oh, there we can. Within the dead garden, she placed the people she had formed. Hmm. Oh god, the music is so enchanting here. So hypnotizing. There we go. <laughs> um. Sie ließ aus den nassen. Yeah, I'm kind of just free this number. She raised the tree of unlife from the wet mud at the center of the garden. The tree of evil. Unlife. And she became the maiden of sorrow. Solange der Baum des Unlebens steht, steht auch sie und gebier gebiert ewiges Leid in dieser Welt, Zeit in dieser Welt. As long as the tree of the not life is standing, she is also existing. Let's see. For as long as it stands, so too shall she stand. Breathing the pain into this world. Gebiert. Ah, okay. In 
this area, your actions will have consequences. Do I want to wake up or do I want to pass away into the afterlife? Is that the threat? Do I want to shriek out, use my voice, and show that there's still life in me? I'm gonna push the button. Show activity. <laughs> You're not sure how it works. It's sort of like our voice, I feel. Oh my fucking god! Jesus Christ! Jesus Christ! Jesus Christ! <laughs> I didn't read this, did I? I don't think I read this. I'm gonna read this first. Child's story. Oh, I have tears. Child's story. The pretty music. <laughs> Pretty music. There was pretty music. There was inspirational music. This is not pretty music. <laughs> this is you're gonna die music. <sighs> okay. In my darkest hours, it is only music that saves me. Is there a heart in the world that cannot be softened by it? Yeah, your own heart right now, I think. If this indeed is you. We need to make her stop fighting with father. There's a tree that they spoke of. Okay, so when she goes over to the other side here, I'm gonna go to the left. Ah! Oh, okay. Okay, this is bad. Oh, holy fuck! Holy fuck! She cannot... She cannot go and land. That's good. Yeah, this is us sort of moaning, isn't it? We're trying to like wake up. Or at the very least to show that we are moaning. Oh, go, 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 Put a symbol of a heart affixed. Um, violin. Bright light. I'm not sure if this is Song of War or what it is, but I, I think it's us moaning. Nothing else here. Don't be mad, you hurt me. She doesn't want to hurt me, but she hurts me. Okay, two more corners to go. Okay, and we go. Oh! God, I feel like she's so close every time.
Okay, I should have waited. I should have waited. I should have waited. Okay, this. I don't have all I think. Yeah, I don't have all I think. I I messed up. One, two, three. Oh my god, she's right there. Gus Tiffany was two. Oh yeah. Here we are. Oh. I'm gonna go this way. Oh she's right there. Oh. There's still a red one. Ah oh, frick. Dead ahead, I think. Okay, go, go! Ugh. This is very stupid, but I feel I run faster sideways. That was this. Oh no, I have to do all! I have to do all within a certain time, probably. That is very mean! Oh, this is still going. Yeah, yeah. There it turned off. So I have to be very quick. Go, 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 go. <laughs> You're still going. God, how? This is so mean. Huh. Move along, move. Oh my god, the way she looks. No, 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 I... Okay. Okay. Okay, that was... Uh, oh, ow! Oh, Jesus. Okay, run, run, run. It's now or never. No, go! Go, go man! Go! Uh, why is this red? Why is this red? Okay, I'm gonna wait because it probably means that one has deactivated. That's probably it. Okay, it still hasn't turned... Um, ...red for the other one, so I'll probably have missed one somehow. Oh, in the middle, maybe. Fuck that, I'm not running to the middle. I'm not running to the middle. <laughs> But I might have to. She's guarding the tree. Maybe that's why she walks around it. I'm gonna try to run to the middle, but it's gonna be a big mistake. Middle! God, that's so creepy. That is so freaking creepy. No, wait. These are like the candles, aren't they? I either have them white or green, or I have them red. That is the choice, isn't it? So if I, if I pick... That's why there are two. 
That's why there are two. Oh, ow! Ah, that barbed wire. So I don't have to operate all of them, I only have to operate the color I want. Green. Now all are green. Now all are green. Because I just interacted with the green ones. Okay, so... She stopped? Does that mean that... That I can approach her? Hello? Let's have a look at the tree first. Hello? What's this in your heart? This thorn in your heart. Yeah, look at what you become. You have a yeah, you have a cross on your heart because that's another telltale sign that it's our mother. <laughs> Wait, she talked about dying earlier. Does that mean that either she has the hateful tree? Or she dies? Did I pick the right thing? <laughs> uh. Oh, where are we now? Fragment of a mirror. Just for a moment, you could see your reflection in the shard of glass. But I can see straight through it as well, so... Chapter 2, Corruption. Ah. So that was just chapter 1. <laughs> that was the... The sharp weapon that was plunged into her... Chest. Maybe from her father? Well, I suppose, yeah, also because it has this eagle at the end, at the handle here. And we know our father seemed very patriotic. So, uh. <gasps> Walk the path of corruption? Yeah, but I wanted to free her from the corruption. Green, you know. Just like in the start of the game, we wake up here. Where's this out of the closet now? I'm not sure if that was us being Paul and Johannes talking to us sort of in a weird memory like thing. Or if that was sort of us speaking to our brother. You know what, Johannes? I think you deserve some rest before you take on another traumatizing dream. Oh, the knife is here. The dagger's heavier than it looks. 
This was mine. Now it's yours. Stand straight, Paul. <coughs> <coughs> Your father is a cripple. He took your grandmother's life when he was born. And now he is a cripple still because he doesn't stand straight and tall. The boy can't even ride a horse. Your brother is not of sound mind. He has your wretched mother's blood. My legacy lies in your hands now. You hear me? The Cadet Academy will make an upright man of you. In spite of your parents, their never-ending suffering, their pain, the cowardice is in your blood. You must purge it. You are the only one worthy of the name von Schmidt and of my dagger. It's your duty. Do you have... Thank you for the compliment, but I'm not going to take it. My first impression was that he was wounded in battle and talking to his son, as in my father, and this was the grandfather speaking, but I suppose that we were at an elderly home and I was talking to him alone. And it was his dying moments. But yeah. Johannes lay down a little bit more. We shall continue this when you rejuvenated a bit with a bit more nice memories. Dream of cats, dogs, and foxes. Good night. <laughs> <laughs>